Good morning, good morning from Chicago, the risk management capital of the world. I'm Alan Duckman here at the CME Group with your morning market stir for Tuesday, February 24th. Quiet Monday, markets did bounce back to unchanged. That's where the E-mini S&P futures settled. 2107 unchanged, did not make new highs, but did come back from negative activity most of the day. Dow futures down 19, 18,085. New highs were made, NASDAQ, tech, believe it or not, up six and a half at 44.44 and one half new highs there. The dollar getting a little bit more firm, up 32 on the day at 94.65, had a high of 95.02. So 95 is an interesting resistance level as we've seen it drift here in the last three weeks. The euro currency finished down 63 at 113.36. Saw some action, some buying bounce in the bond market that's been drifting lower for more than a month. It was up one full basis point and 10 ticks, 110 at 145.11 to push yields back down a little bit. Crude oil down below the $50 a barrel level for the second time in the last three weeks on a closing basis at $49.45, down $1.40. The low of the session was $48.70, so let's watch that 50 level on a weekly pivot basis. Gold down $4 at $12.01. So after the unchanged to mix action yesterday, the where did the market stand on this Tuesday morning? Well, we're off a little bit. We're down three quarters of a point in the E-mini S&P at $21.06. The Dow futures are up 10 ticks, up 10 points at 18,095, and the Nasdaq down two and a half at 44.42. So relatively unchanged action here in the early morning. The dollar's up 14 at 94.80, pressing on that 95 level. The euro 113.27 down 13. Bonds are giving back 11 ticks from yesterday. That big bounce. We're at 144.31. The yields right now on the 30-year 2.68 and the 10-year note 208. So holding above that 2. Point uh, 2.0 percent uh, support. Crude oil is down 20 cents right now at 49.70, and gold's off two dollars with the firmness in the dollar. So to wrap up the current action, with two hours to go before the cash stock market open, we're steady to mix. Down three quarters of a point in the S&P, down up 10 in the Dow futures, and down two and a half in the Nasdaq 100 futures. I will see you early Wednesday morning for your morning market stir to set up your trading day. Alan Nuckman here at the CME Group, where it all comes back to commodities.